Oh, look what happened to that stop sign. I karate kicked it with karate. And that's what happens when you get me mad. I'll karate kick you. Bam! You like that? I karate kicked that stop sign for you in the face. I karate kicked that stop sign in the stop sign face because it's Memorial Day. So happy Memorial Day stop sign. I karate kicked you in the face. And as a bonus, you guys are getting so much today. Let me just explain what's happening right now. First of all, happy Memorial Day. It's Memorial Day. Uh, we're going to take you to the lake for Memorial Day. And you're going to get a bonus video. So you're going to get a Memorial Day video. I kicked the stop sign in the face for you. And you're probably going to get a Lego video too. Lego, Benny, spaceship, spaceship, spaceship. You're getting two videos today. So happy Memorial Day to you for that. You're welcome for that. Awesome. And uh, actually, you know what else I'm going to do for you? I'm going to put... That stop sign was in another video we did called Stop Sign Steroids. I'm going to put a link somewhere... Maybe on my face. I'm going to put it right on my face. Um, just click my face and it'll take you to that video. It's a funny video. But watch this video first and then watch the Lego Benny Spaceship video. And then watch uh, Stop Sign Steroids. You have a lot of videos to watch. But happy Memorial Day! Look at it. It's turning into water. i got to get it in a cooler. Or it's not going to be very icy. What? Oh, what do you call the beach? What do you call this beach? It's a swallow bay. <laughs> We've arrived at Swallow Bay. Okay guys, so as you can see, we have arrived at the lake. And you heard, you heard it. Okay, so Swallow Cove. So that's what we're gonna call this. We need to go carve it in there. We gotta go carve it up in the rocks there somehow. We've got a pretty cool beach here. It's pretty sandy. It's kind of muddy sometimes. And there's lots of seashells. Look at all the seashells. When we were little, we used to come to these lake all the time, like um, these lakes, and we used to like, there was always someone who carved like stuff in the rock. So what we would do is we would carve it whatever we were. Like there was this guy named Gonzo, and he carved his name Gonzo into the rock formation. So we call the beach still to this day like Gonzo. Ah, there's bees here. Okay, we're gonna need a rock. We're gonna go carve it up in there, in that mountain right over there. So here's what we're gonna need. We're going to need uh, a good solid carving rock and um, or maybe we'll use this beer can oh yeah this will work this is gonna be our we're gonna do it old style old school style this is the way they used to do it in the Egyptian days back in the Egyptians used to carve stuff into the pyramids like this yeah I was explaining how when we were little we would go to the um, mountain and it was always carved. Yeah, like yeah, there's a name. You would just appear for hours and hours. Yeah, but like the way we knew the name of the beach was because it was carved. Right. Gonzo. Under the mountain, it was Gondo. That's right. what I was just saying. I was just telling Gonzo. you about that. Okay. And then Todd said that this is called Swallow Bay. Oh. Which is a funny name, <laughs> Swallow Bay. So I said, what we need to do is carve Swallow Bay. Swallow Bay into the mountains here, into the. We just carve it. We just carve it. We're just gonna carve Swallow Bay. Right? Look at this, perfect! All it's right. gonna say, Swallow. right there, Swallow Bay. Right on the map. The then everyone will know Forever where we're at. And if we ever get lost and we're driving around on the jet skis or whatever, we know we're at Swallow Bay. Swallow Bay, sweet! Okay, All right. All right. So it's good. We're carving so good. So. We're carving, this is gonna be the best carving thing ever. <laughs> I don't even understand. 
how good this is going to be. Okay. And it's important to name your mountain. I don't even know if this is legal, but who's going to seriously stop us? Well, it already has the name of Swallow Bean, so there's nothing wrong with naming it officially, right? Right. We're actually helping the lake department, whatever that is, and I swear to gosh, I think I'm getting bit by bugs. He's not. He's over. being really melodramatic, people. No, I'm getting he's, bit. He's being melodramatic. There's stuff, it's because of my shirt and the oil. Or They're like could... really attracted to me right now. These yeah. bugs think I'm a bee, like a queen bee or king bee or whatever. He is pretty bright. Oh, he sticks day. out from like a mile away. Bees are trying to pollinize me and I'm trying to carve. <laughs> We're just trying to make a swallow bay for everybody to see. I'm trying to do a public service. Bow! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, awesome. Yeah. Let's go around the tube. Sweet! Okay. So there's the tube. It's pretty cool. It is all done. Dude, that tube is so cool. In slow motion. I'm gonna do the whole thing in slow motion. It's gonna be awesome. Let's do like slow motion boat jumping. Like you jump off the boat, then I'll jump off the boat, but we'll do it in slow motion. Like you jump first, and then and then I'll jump, and then you jump, and we'll slow motion it. So good. You gotta slow mo you slow mo me. Oh, you need that? Oh, there, help me out. I got, I'm holding my cameras. I don't know. <laughs> what am I gonna? I got it. You're gonna have to come up yourself because I don't want to hold it. Hold on. Hey, uh, hold on. Uh, hold on. <laughs> uh, uh, you gotta come and slow out. Slow mo me. <laughs> oh, look at my biceps. Oh my god. Do you see how strong I am? Oh, I mean. <laughs> Well, I can't let the me. camera go. The Bering Sea, I'd be dead. You gotta move out of the way or something. Move out of the way! Come on, are you, somebody's gotta slow mo me. Oh, uh, we're slow, we're doing slow mo shots off the. It's my turn to slow. Help out. No, I can't. You gotta. <laughs> oh, look at that. Biceps. Biceps. They're strong. See, I actually helped you up. Alright, that was good slow mo. Alright, let's do me slow mo one more time. Two black dogs. This black dog one, and this black dog two. But I don't know which black dog was our black dog. How do you know which one's which? <laughs> yeah, but how do you, how can you do it? Oh. I can't tell the difference between these dogs. There's two black dogs. We brought a black dog with us, and now there's another one over here. See, look. And they're like best friends now. It's like, no one knows where they go. No one knows where black dog goes. Look at, but look how funny they are. They're exactly the same. We need hers to say that you I just don't understand. How do you... They're like exactly identical. Is that one yours? This one's mine. <laughs> and this one is yours. No. <laughs> okay, bye black dogs. <laughs> so weird. How do you get a... Straight black dog. Huh. Sad because somebody's probably way over there going, where's my black dog? Look, like, could be anybody. Hey, you're a black dog. And what are the odds that they're exactly alike? So we came with one black dog. Right? Oh, wow. And now there's two black dogs. Yeah, that dog, if you had that dog in your house, he would just run away all the time. Like, your dog does that. <laughs> my dog does that. Do that. And my dog's lonely. See, it's probably just a lonely dog. Constantly. Not a bad dog. Yeah.
Yeah. What happened? They found the owner? Yeah. And they didn't even know he was gone? Yeah. So now this black dog lost a friend. Yeah, she seems upset. Are you sad? You sad, Wheelie? Aww. Oh, you lost her buddy. Here they come. She's going to go off into the sunset, into the water.